Hello YouTube, my name is Veiku and today I'm going to show you how to become even richer in a Pokemon Sword and Shield. So if you want to become a millionaire, this is the video you need to see. Now I made a earlier a video on which you, you can become a millionaire. You can get 1 million Poké Coins in less than one hour in Pokemon Sword and Shield if you guys want to check that one out. Um, I'm going to put the link in the description, you do not need the expansion set for it or anything anything like that. But here's an even faster way. Now, this might be a little bit of an obvious thing, but for me it definitely wasn't and uh, figuring this one out helped me a lot because now I can buy a vitamins forever. Now for this this thing to work, you need to go to Isle of Armor, Training Lowlands, here. Now as I said, the other trick, you could do this in less than one hour, but this trick you need to you need to do a lot of max raids. So this is not fast, but if you're like me and you have done a lot of max raids, and you can get Armorite Ore for max raids, and I really don't use it that much. Sometimes I teach a couple of moves, but I still have a couple of hundred Armorite Ores, and I don't need it for anything. So we talk to this guy, like I have 177, and I have used it a lot, but you get a lot of it, especially from events. Anyways, this guy gives you a really good deal. So couple of armorite ores and this guy gives you a lot of watts, like a lot. Now be patient, that's 24,000. Like before uh, Isle of Armor you could only get 2,000 watts from finding a max raid that was already already active or or maybe Rodam bike, bike challenge thing or whatever, but never before have you been able to get what's this fast now why we need what's let's do this one more time sometimes this guy can actually like get you over one 100,000 or something but this technique will take you literally well i don't know how long the video will be but less than five minutes so we'll just let this guy dig up as much i think that's good enough i guess This all, all comes down to an exchange rate. Now that we have watts, so this basically costs like, how much was it? 21, 21 armorite ore. Now we have all the watts, we go back here. It doesn't matter where you travel on the wild area, you need to find a watt trader. That's what we're here looking for. Now there's a lot of ways you can do this, but this is spend my watts, let's buy some timer balls, and uh, yes please, I would like <laughs> like to have 999. Thank you please, and that was only 30,000. In two minutes we were able, in 20 armorite ore, we were able to get 100,000 almost. Let's trade a little bit more. Just a second. All right, I would like a 1,000 of these these ones too, and we still have. You can. Uh, I guess I could buy myself wishing pieces. This has nothing to do with. And now we simply sell, sell these pokeballs. And if you're like me and you do max raids, and these balls are actually really good on capturing Pokemon, so you don't want to sell all of them. But like having 50 in the bag is quite a lot still. You don't need 1,000 of them. That's nearly impossible to use all of them. Go here. Yes, I would like to sell Pokeballs. I have 1000. And let's keep 50. So we can get almost 500,000 Pokecoins from here and Dusk Balls over here. Yep. So now we made pretty much, well, little less than 1 million but it took us it's not this video haven't even been five five minutes long anyways that's the video Sub subscribe if you already haven't i'd enjoy and liked having you around here comment below let's talk about pokemon my name is veiku 
Hope you enjoyed. See you next time. Bye bye.